just in one, oh, two. Oh. Can you hear me? Of course I can hear you. I'm standing right beside you. I don't know why I don't just use a tape recorder. I'll record it at my end, but I need to be able to hear what's going on. The guy wants to talk to me. Nothing's going to happen. Where are you meeting him? Uh... Mike's A1 auto body? And it's the front for the whole loan sharking operation. The guy breaks legs for loan sharks, you know. I think we need some sort of code word. In case you get into trouble, a word that lets me know you need help. The word help itself comes to mind? No, we need a word we can just casually drop in a conversation, like mellifluous or chowder. I don't even want to know what goes on inside that head. Great stuff. And these quotes, are you sure? Have you got confirmation? Mike lends money, I collect it. I'm good at it. You know, there's a lot of amateurs out there trying to break into this business, but I'm the best. People here, I'm coming. They pay. What do you do if they don't? There's no don't. They pay. Plumbers to bank presidents. I speak their language. The language of fear. Okay. I'm going to get this over to legal, see what they say, but I think we've got a front page. Great work. Hi, Chuck Jones. I've just about given up on you. Sorry. I, uh, I couldn't read my own writing. Ah, it's no problem. Joe, right? Yeah. Quite a bike you got there, Joe. Gosh, I always wanted one of those. I guess I'm a little too old now, though. Nah, no, nah, you're never too old. Well, when your first thought is that you're gonna fall off, maybe you are. But anyway, uh, the university placement office said that you hadn't, hadn't done this sort of thing before. Yeah, that's right. Well, there's nothing to it. You just gotta uh, water the cats and feed the plants. I'm going to be away skiing in Switzerland. I'm going to be back in two weeks' time. I'm going to leave straight from the office. So uh, you just wander around and make yourself at home. And if you have any questions, you just give me a ring at the office. i got to run. Oh, uh... How can I reach you in case anything comes up? You can't. I'm going to be so high up in that mountain, only God can reach me. Oh, and Joe, if anybody calls, don't tell them I'm away. It's not, not good to advertise you're on vacation, you know? Especially when you owe people money. Enjoy the house. Thank you. 
on Alarms Unlimited. We're canvassing the neighborhood. We've got some off-season specials you might be interested in. Oh, we're fine, thanks. Uh, Mr. Jones home? No, he's at work. Well, what time will he be back? I'm not sure. What in the name of God are you doing? He's at work. Of course he's at work. Inside, inside. Don't flash the gun on the street, idiot. What do you guys want? Who are you? Let's just say that I'm a debt collector. Who are you? Well, that's his son. That's why we came straight in. Got it all planned, eh? Give me that. This is what's gonna happen. You're gonna call your father at the bank. You're gonna tell him to come straight home. You're gonna tell him that if he calls the police, some bad people are gonna shoot you. And then he's gonna go back to the bank with us and make a little withdrawal. Right between the eyes. And Brendan? He's in Switzerland. What? Skiing. No, 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 no. You, you told me. No, no, me. shut up. Let me think. He can identify us. He'll probably, uh, he'll probably stop by the office before he goes. I could probably reach a call. Tell him to come home. No cause for alarm. Just don't use the word prisoner or, or hostage or anything of that ilk. Ilk? It's a word. Shut up! Call him. We can use a phone in the, uh, in the, in the kitchen. I could kill you. Joyce, calm down. Don't use my name. Okay, what's the number? Five, 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 zero, one. No funny stuff. Mr. Jones, please. Thank you. Uh, I'm sorry, you got the wrong number. Dad, it's me. Joe? I need you to come home for a few minutes. What? I'm serious. Dad, I need to see you before you go to Switzerland. <laughs> what is this? What's the matter with your voice? No. You just sound mellifluous. Come home, I'll fix you a nice bowl of chowder. What do you mean, which house? I'm at a... We haven't eaten in three days. He's up to something. If anybody comes here besides your father, you know you're in big trouble, right? Come on, honey, you gotta eat something. You're hypoglycemic. She's got this blood sugar thing. Shut up. Get him out of here before I lose my temper. She doesn't mean anything by that. Actually, she's a very nice person. She's got a good education. You know, you saw her say ilk. I'm sure she's a very nice person. It's me. I, I always screw up. You're being too hard on yourself. No, 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 it's, it's true. She's always mad at me. She's not mad at you. She's, uh, she's mad at herself. She just takes it out on you. No, 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 it's, it's me. I'm, I'm, I'm no good at anything. Sure you are. Look, you're good at this. No, not, not really. We've never done this before. I don't even know if this gun works. Do you want to find out? What's that? A passport. Your father's passport? Since when do you go to Switzerland without a passport? Must have forgotten it. I don't like this. Ed, go upstairs and check the rest of the house. OK, I'll make us something to eat. No, you keep your mouth shut around Ed. He gets upset. Ed's not as dumb as you think he is, you know. You just make him nervous. Oh, I'll make him nervous, all right. Ed really loves you, Joyce. If you'd only let him. Oh, man, you know, I am really sick of smart mouth people. You know that? I am not Ed, and I am not interested in your crap. So you will be doing yourself a very big favor if you keep your mouth shut. <laughs> 